Mr. Man, we're going back with another day today. It's cold. It's cold where I live. I live in San Diego, California. It's cold. And they're like, we have a towel and shit. Where are you going to the pool? No, I'm going to the pool. It'll be too cold to go to the pool. I'm going to the jacuzzi right now, but this is a quick video for you guys. A quick, whatever you want to call it. I want to know, what are you guys doing for Thanksgiving? Leave in the comments down below. I'd like to know. What are you guys doing for Thanksgiving? What are your plans for this weekend? If you guys, if you guys are flying out, visiting people, whatever, whatever have you, but I'd like to know in the comments down below. Leave it in the comments. Like my video and all that. But what are you guys doing for Thanksgiving? I'd like to know your um, your feedback. Oh, I'm gonna go visit family. I'm gonna go take an airplane trip to go visit my family back east, central, midwest, Mount west, wherever. That's fine. Just let me know what you guys are doing. I'll be going down to, um, I should be leaving tomorrow early, but for the clock. Gonna get up but for the clock really early. I'm gonna get up early. I'm gonna get one of you in time to go have breakfast. I'm gonna have breakfast with the fam. Apparently, that I live in Simi Valley, California. And that's, um, you're probably thinking I'm speaking so fast. It's Sun Valley. It's Simi Valley, California. I'm gonna go there at but for the clock. Get there so we can watch the Eagles. Versus Detroit Lions football game to play at 9:30 in the morning in uh, West Time, so 2:00 to 12:30. They're gonna play, and there's a game. Right there. There's like three games. It's always the Lions. All the Lions are always the first game. I think the Lions are always home on on um, Thanksgiving games, and so with the Cowboys. And the Cowboys are also play Thanksgiving. So yeah, my brother's a diehard Eagles fan. I'm a diehard. I'm a Vikings fan. So my dad's a Charger fan. My mom doesn't really care about football, but she would just go. Come on, the Chargers, and we live right next to the Chargers Stadium, but she would just go for the Chargers. But anyways, I'm a Vikings fan. We don't play. We don't play till Sunday. My Chargers don't play till Sunday, so the only team that plays is my brother's team is the Eagles. He's a diehard. When they lose, he is down. Um. So yeah, leave in the comments. What do you guys be doing? You guys are gonna just have Thanksgiving and stay to stay at your family members for a week for the week. Or you're just gonna have Thanksgiving and come back home, whatever, whatever happens. You're gonna have Thanksgiving at your house. What are you gonna cook? What's your favorite thing to cook on Thanksgiving? I'd like to know. Leave it in the comments down below. Like this video, leave me a comment, subscribe for more. But I'd like to know your feedback on I like, I cook, we cook, whatever. I don't know what you guys cook. Turkey, we cook a turkey, we cook a ham, honey baked ham, or just a ham, we cook, or we don't eat turkey, we ham, or we eat turkey, not ham, or we eat deep fry our turkey, we bacon wrap our turkey, you deep fry the ham, or you bacon wrap ham, I don't know what you guys do, leave it in the comments, there's a lot of people that do deep fry the ham, deep, I mean, you could do that too, but deep fry the turkey and they do it into the house, you're really supposed to do, take a, take a, Call that big old stock pot. Put your turkey inside the stock pot. Fill the water up to the part where it, fill, where it over, where it fills, where it covers the whole turkey. Dump the water. That's how much oil you need. You let the whole oil heat up. You take a hook. You drop it in. People do it outside. And people do it inside. They burn down the house. You know, a lot of people burn down the houses and all this crazy stuff. So don't do it in your house. Do it away. Do it on the flat top. Don't do it on the grass. We can burn the grass and there goes everything. If you have a wood fence, there goes your wood fence. So. Be, be safe on Thanksgiving, you guys. Try not to burn on your houses. Cook your turkey right. Don't get nobody sick with salmonella from the turkey. I don't know. My, my favorite is turkey. My mom's uh, green bean casserole. I like stuffing. I love I love gravy. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be carving the turkey. I'm actually be, might be making the turkey this year. I'm also might be making the gravy and the pan sauce. So we need butter, some flour, some roux. Easy, just put some butter, some flour, some of the pan drippings, and a little bit of stock or whatever. A mere paw, and you're good to go. But, yeah, that's, that's what I'm gonna do. You guys are saying, what's a mere paw? A mere paw is a French thing. It's, I think it's 25, 50, 25, 25. I think it's like 50 onion, 25 celery, 25 carrot. You put, I always put some something in my turkey. I don't know, I might put in this, this year. Um, what else? Maybe some le le lemon, put some lemon in there, some onion, some garlic, whatever, some rosemary at the time. Salt and pepper on the outside, olive oil, salt and pepper, in the oven it goes. It's simple, easy.
some people would do like Italian on it with um, herb seasoning or whatever they put on it. Mine just quick salt and pepper, olive oil, rub it down with olive oil, some oil, salt and pepper in the thing, stuff, cook the bird. And I need to do like some probably roasted potatoes on the side, but we're gonna mash potatoes probably. Or, or, um, I wanna do the mac and cheese, my favorite. I mean, not my favorite, but I like to, do, I like to eat that sometimes. Some people think it's my favorite is mac and cheese. Because they, because they, well, I'm thankful for the mac and cheese. I'm think, I just do the same thing for the food, family, friends, everybody that just comes out. If you, if you guys do that, I don't know. Some people don't do grace or, or thankful for it. It's fine. I'm not judging any of you guys. But I, we do that. I don't know about this year. We might not do thankful for it. We might do grace. I don't know. I'm usually pray for you. Thank you for this meal. Da, 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 da. And we eat. Usually, but since my since half of my mom's side of the family is in, is in Kansas and Kentucky, we're not. So I have my dad's side of the family. We kind of don't really do that, but we just buy. I don't even know if we say grace, honestly. My mom's side of the family say grace and say what we're thinking for. I'm thinking for everybody. I'm just. I'm literally. Here I go. I'm going to start it early because I know it's Wednesday, but I'm thankful for all my YouTube fans that subscribe to my channel thank you for everybody on my youtube i'm thankful for having a youtube channel thank you for growing i'm like 18 18 subscribers or something i'm growing i want to grow more i'm thankful for everybody my family my friends my parents for raising me having raising me right you know thank you for i'm going far in life i'm thankful for my school i'm doing in my school i'm thankful for just going far and doing great in my culinary school. Just thankful for everything, the way to get around, transportation. I'm thankful for transportation. I take the bus. I'm thankful for the metropolitan transportation, the bus, the transit around here. I'm thankful for that. I'm thankful for everything. I'm thankful for just having a roof over my head, honestly. I'm just thankful for God just to give us that meal, to praise down on us and say thank you for this wonderful meal. Thank you. We just, without him, he's nothing. But, you know, I'm thankful for having our lives, you know. I'm so thankful I'm still alive and well, and I'm thankful for everything, you know. I can go on and on what I'm thankful for, but I'm thankful for literally having a life, waking up every day, waking up, brushing my teeth, having breakfast, getting ready to get my hair done, getting ready for school, you know. I'm thankful for all that, honestly, but there's a lot to be thankful for, and yeah, you guys should be thankful. You guys should thank your parents and thank everybody because if it wasn't for your parents, then you guys wouldn't be, be where you're at right now. I'm thankful for just, you know, it's good. If you guys don't have a family to feed or people to eat, go to one of your little shelters, homeless shelters, or um, like a Salvation Army. They provide turkey. They provide a whole meal for you guys. Some people, they provide them today and usually provide them tomorrow. So you can eat today and tomorrow. Um, it's just great. If you can go to house to house and people that don't have family that don't eat and donate a box of stuffing, a turkey, a ham, something, dinner rolls, to pies, anything if they can't afford it, but they, they can't afford to cook it, but they have all the stuff to cook it. They have all the, you know, the baking sheets out to cook it. It would be great to just, just to provide them all the food that they need. It's honestly... Just great. So I'd like to say thank you, Angry Grandpa and Kibby on the camera, aka Pickle Boy. You, you guys are awesome for donating all that, or the like 40 something boxes of food. We're trying to go for 100 next year. You guys are awesome. Um, it's just awesome to give back, honestly. If I could, I would, but I just don't have the time and the money. I don't have a, I'm out of a job right now. I had a job last year, a couple years. And uh, the, uh, my job closed down because we weren't making that much money, so they went back to catering, and and, I, and my parents moved here, so I just moved here with them, and it's hard for me to find a job right now to just get to the where I'm at. But I'm thankful for God that I had a job and try to get one right now. I'm trying to look for one that can suit my needs, like cooking and other stuff, hospitality, and a lot of but cooking, nutritious health, and all that. So just some just thankful for everything, but. Let me know what you guys are thinking for. Leave in the comments what you guys are thinking for. What you guys going to have for Thanksgiving. What's your favorite Thanksgiving food or meal or something to eat or dessert. Whatever have you. Leave in the comments down below. And, um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. Like this video. Leave me a comment. 
subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys probably Sunday, latest Monday. If you guys watch any of my videos of anything, I'll see you guys probably Sunday or Monday and talk about Thanksgiving and what you guys eat and what you guys do. So, see you guys next time. Bye.